Good afternoon. You know, in my last video, I showed you my strawberry container um, planter that we made. And also, you know, told you about my love for container gardens. Well, we have cattle, and I save their mineral buckets. And the ones that we can't use or the cows are broken, I'd like to make container gardens out of those. So I'd like to kind of share with you some that I've gotten some that I've got, what I've got planted, and what I'm doing next. Okay? So, I've noticed that my onions are needing a little attention. Even though that they're growing quite well, I still think that they need a little bit of fertilizer. So, I just have some of your standard all-purpose 12-12-12 fertilizer that I'm going to kind of put a handful or two in there and before I water so that maybe that can kind of boost their growing. And something else I like to do after I get my fertilizer in here, I kind of like to kind of loosen up the soil just so that they can have some air in and around them because I want a good plump onion when these get done. These are our potatoes and I've been wanting to raise potatoes successfully in containers ever since last year. So what I'm trying this year is a, is a new technique. I have put maybe a quarter of soil in here and then whenever they get up to about like the about this size you're supposed to cover them back up with some more soil. So that's what I'm going to do tonight and um, get them covered up. And as you can see, container gardening, you can do it anywhere, and it's easy, and it's not as time-consuming as a whole garden. But I do love my whole garden. Now I've got my onions fertilized, I've got more dirt on my potatoes, and I'm so proud of my lettuce. I kind of think that my lettuce is kind of ready to harvest, which I'm excited about. And I have got radishes, and I have got sweet beets back here. Um, I'm going to get it all kind of watered in, and...
And to sum up my container garden video, I would kind of like to show you my celery that I had planted earlier. Um, I think it's doing really well here, and what I've done with it is I've put some cedar shavings over it just to kind of help hold in the moisture. And I think it's loving this spot, and I get so excited, I cannot wait to harvest the celery because I love celery. And that kind of sums up my container gardening. I know if I can do it, you can do it. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, leave us a comment on what you would like for, to see us do. And most of all, you can plan anything if I can. And be looking for my next project is edible front porch fashion. What do you think? Let me know what you think and let me know if you have any, any suggestions on what I can plant that it would be totally edible on my front porch.